Well, welcome to this top secret video. So the story is, in July, we are going back to France. In Paris, there is an emission zone, low emissions enforcement. A bit like what we've got now in London and in Birmingham. So it is called a ZFE zone. So it's for low emission zone. So that's in Paris. That's a permanent thing in Paris that is staying there. Now, what uh, has happened in France since 2020 is they've got some new zones called ZPA zones. Now, ZPA zones work a little bit different to the ZFE zone. The ZFE zone is a permanent low emission zone. ZPA zone is certain cities and towns and areas in France. What they're doing is they're monitoring the pollution level. So the ZPA is for cities and towns where if the pollution level goes above a certain point, they then bring in these low emission zones. So these, these are like a, they're like a temporary measure. It might be like for 24 hours, 48 hours, but they can be brought in at any time they want and they can be enforced any time they want. So our route, we're not going into Paris uh, when we go to France, so we don't have to worry about Paris. But all the other areas we are going to fall into this ZPA zone. Now our big problem is Goose. Goose owns a 1999 Suzuki Bandit 1200. ZFE zones, the permanent zones, and the ZPA, these temporary zones, you're only allowed into these areas if the vehicle was registered after July 2000. So Goose's bike is a 1999, so he's, he falls outside the age range. So basically, Goose's bike is not allowed. It's not allowed in Paris, it's completely banned in Paris. If these other ZPA zones kick in while we're there, if the pollution goes up, then Goose is banned from those areas as well. The problem we've got is he's, at some of these other areas, we've got the hotels in there. So Goose won't even be allowed to get to the hotel. So you get a £65 fine, that's what I've read so far. Uh, but our only concern is, you know, he's, does Goose take the gamble? Do you do it and see if you get copped? Problem is, is in the first city, if Goose does get copped and then he gets stopped again in the next one, obviously he's then a repeating motor offence. Goose has pulled out of the front tour. He said he can't afford to look at another bike this year, so Goose is not coming to France. He's absolutely gutted by it, we're gutted by it. And then another thing is, I think they're called Air Critique. I think they're called Air Critique. And basically it's, a, it's an emission sticker you're, you're supposed to put on your bike or on your vehicle showing what emissions class your vehicle is. You know, is it a Euro 5, is it a Euro 4? Obviously Goose's is that old, he can't have a sticker on it. So obviously his bike's gonna stand out like a sore thumb that it's old. So it's a bit of a gamble. The part of this story which is top secret, not even the guys in Motor F know about this. And the reason being, because I'm all blabber mouths, none of them are keep the mouths shut, they'd end up dropping some it out. So, so what Richie's wife has done, she has agreed to buy him a newer motorbike. So Goose has not got an idea about this. It's been an absolute nightmare trying to keep this a secret from him. So she's going to buy him a newer bike, which is going to allow him to get to France. And what she's also done, she has paid for his Euro Tunnel ticket to get there and his ferry crossing back as well. And he's even said on the day we go down to Folkestone to get the tunnel, he's going to ride down with us. And then once we get the tunnel, he's going to ride home. So it's probably going to break his heart, but he said, you know, it's, at least in one way, he'll feel a little bit part of it. So that's it. So the secret is, Goose is going to have a bike. Well, not Goose is going to have a bike. Goose has got a new bike. He loves the Suzuki V-Strom 1000. That bike, he thinks it is beautiful. You know, I tried to get a bit of information out of him. I said, so, I said, what's, what's your favourite colour one? Do you like the black and yellow one? or? And the one he likes the most is the white. I think the tank is white. The bike's black, the tank's white. You know, I think it's got some grey on the side with red writing. So black, red, and white. That's his favorite one. I've gone through every one of them on Bike Trader, eBay, uh, Gumtree, Facebook Marketplace. 
I even ended up joining a Suzuki V-Strom Facebook group, just so I could see if there was any for sale in there. And then I stumbled on a bike. I stumbled on a bike, let me show you. And the bike I stumbled on was at a dealer in Swindon called Blade Motorcycles. That's the bike. So it's a red, white, black and grey Suzuki V-Strom, the one he likes. It's in mint condition. It's got about 20,000 on the clock. It's got the full luggage, uh, heated grips. So it's got all the works on it. So I called Blade Motorcycles and spoke to the sales guy, George. Right, so this is the bike I found. It's at Blade Motorcycles in Swindon. 2017 plate, black and white, which is the one he likes. It's got the Suzuki side panniers, Oxford heated grips. Uh, there's no top box, but he can take the top box off his Suzuki Bandit. So let's give him a call. Let's see if it's still available. Visit blademotorcycles.co.uk to view our full range of new motorcycles and to book your test ride today. Hey, just as a customer at the moment, can I get him to call you straight back? Yeah, no problem. He's got my mobile number. Thanks very much. So I'll just take it just in case. Oh, yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah, that's fine. Brilliant. Thanks for your call, sir. No problem. You? Thanks very much. Bye-bye. Thanks. Bye. Now, George has been absolutely fantastic. Explain the story to him that, you know, I'm trying to buy this bike blind on his behalf by his wife and he doesn't know about it. And... You know, he's done everything he can to help us. I said, obviously, I said, we can't get down there to come and look at the bike. So the bike's being delivered to us. It's coming on a, on a van. It's being couriered to us. So we've put the deposit down. We've paid for the bike in full. The bike's been serviced today. We're at the 1st of February today. The bike's had its service. And George is going to be contacting me tomorrow to let me know when the, the van's going to be arriving. So I've just had the message come through off George. Hi there Craig, only George, sorry I've missed your um, call earlier and uh, your messages, I've just been inundated with um, uh, walking customers today, so apologies, I've just seen your email, um, yes that's absolutely fine, I can get that sent over to your um, his son's house, that's not not an issue, um, I just wanted to double check, I know you've sent me the screenshot for the um, bank details, has that now been sent, if so great, can you let me know and then I can then chase up with accounts to make sure that the money is in the bank, um, and then I can then obviously organise getting that um, um, invoiced and on a van and scheduled to uh, get over to you but yeah if you can let me know that that information i've just stated that'd be great um and yeah look forward to hearing back from you cheers Craig, thanks bye so all we've got to do now is arrange delivery of the bike so anyhow paid for the bike <clears throat> bike's done waiting for it to come so what i've got to do now is the hard part is we've got to try and get this bike to him so what we're going to do the bike's being delivered to his son's house so we're going to hide it round the back in his son's garden i'm going to get from work because it's only around the corner from where we work from work i'm going to go straight there wait at his son's house and then his son's going to find him and say something like you know oh, my windows have been smashed can you come round and help me obviously goose will come flying around um I'll be there at the house. More than likely, he's probably going to say, what are you doing here? So what I'm going to do, I'm going to say, oh, I was just passing. I've been stopped speaking to your son, Tom, and I've just got something for you. Get him to turn around, and I'll say, open your eyes, and then you'll see that bike. And then obviously then we'll reveal, you know, oh, by the way, you know, this is your present off your wife. She bought you a bike. So that's going to be absolutely amazing. I cannot wait to see his, his little face light up with excitement. And his son did say, he said, actually, he said, I bet he never cried when I was born. He said, I bet he cries when he sees this bike. So it's going to be mega to see because he's been so down about it. You know, the bike is absolutely beautiful. It is a beautiful bike. It really is nice. And what George did as well, because obviously we only saw the photos. George did a walk around. He videoed it on his phone of the bike. He went close up, sent me the video so I could see it. So I knew the bike was in good condition and I was more than happy with it. It's absolutely brilliant. 
Hi there, Craig. It's only George here at Blade again. Um, so yeah, no, look forward to your call late this afternoon on this lovely V-Strom uh, that we'll be putting a deposit down for your friend as a little surprise gift. Um, but yeah, no, if I'll run through everything, um, nice little video walk around just so you can get an idea of condition. Because right, I know obviously videos, uh, so, sorry, pictures don't give these bikes justice on the web. Um, but yeah, really, really clean bike. Really, really clean bike. Radiator's all intact along with obviously the uh, lower portion of the uh, exhaust. Same goes for the front end. Uh, we've got an MRA uh, front screen on this too. A um, bunch of other goodies as well. Um, you've also got the genuine Suzuki panniers, the Jivvy rack as well, um, which is all on there. And um, we've also got the ring so you can put the uh, tank bag on as well. Uh, the Oxford heated grips. Um, but yeah, really, 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 really nice bike. Um, it's very well looked after. But yeah, keys packed a lot. Um, obviously, it will go through a full 50 point pre delivery inspection um, before it leaves here, um, along with if it's due a service and or MOT. Um, obviously, we will uh, undertake that as well. Um, but yeah, look forward to your call later this afternoon. Get a deposit down and uh, get this bike out to you. So yeah, all right. Cheers. Bye. Hello. Hey, Craig. Hello, George. How are you doing? Hello. I'm all right. How are you? I'm good, mate. Thank you. Good, 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 good. Um, yeah, she's all booked on. Hopefully, it will be tomorrow for collection. Uh, failing that, going to be Monday. So they basically work on like a seven-day window. No problem. Um, so she's all, she's all booked in. Um, obviously, if it's later than that, then I will let you know. Um, yeah. But the moment it's getting collected, or they give me a phone call to say they're on their way, then obviously I can call you. But and then I've given them your mobile number, so they've got a formal contact. Brilliant. And I've also obviously given them the delivery address, and then also your name as a contact reference to sort of liaise with you, because obviously I don't want, really want Richard knowing, clearly. Yeah, so, fantastic. Um, <laughs> but yeah, all, all booked in and whatnot. Bikes ready to rock and roll. Um, she's had, yeah, service, MOT, the work, so it's um, it's all fresh and ready to rock. That's brilliant. Um, but yeah, great. I'll, say I'll keep you in the loop. No, what is it? Picked up, obviously I'll give you a tinkle. Um, but yeah, hopefully either tomorrow, if not Monday. So that's Lovely. Like that's brilliant. Brilliant. All Cheers, right, George. Great. See you, mate. Thanks. Cheers, bye. 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 Right now we've got to be careful because Goose is here. Hi right, buddy. You got your coat zipped up properly today then? Yeah. My goose feathers are coming out though. Yeah, I'm just doing um, an update on um on France and that so you ain't coming then buddy. Have you gutted? Next year, we'll do the Alps next year. You, should be, you should be able to get one for then, shouldn't you? Yeah, that one next year. It's just a, a moving house, isn't it? It is what it is, unfortunately, this year. Yeah, there's more things in night. Right? It's going to be good to see your little squirrel face light up. So enjoy the rest of this video now, which you're going to see Goose being surprised with the bike of his life. Enjoy. Oosh. Hello to everyone at Motor Rev. This is your new pride and joy. Richard, I believe this is yours. This is a surprise present that's been uh, sorted out by your wife and uh, lovely friend Craig. So yeah, this is from Blade Motorcycles here in Swindon. We're getting it loaded up on the truck now over to you. Uh, yeah, straight on the van and uh, over to you shortly. But yeah, I hope you're over the moon with it. Absolutely fantastic bit of kit. And we'd love to hear your feedback and what you think on the new ride. Cheers. Okay, it's the big day. We're at Goosey's son's house, Tom's. Just had the call. The van's a couple of minutes away. National and European motorcycle transport. This is the baby. Hi, pal. Don't mind, don't mind me filming, do you? Hey, we have YouTubers doing it in also. <laughs> so, do you know the story of this one? I don't know. It's a secret. He doesn't know he's had it. His wife's brought it him. Oh, okay. Oh, you're not the bloke who's... No, 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 no. No, I work with him, so I've got to come round, open the gates, oh, all right, get the okay. bike in, then we're bringing him around after work. Oh, does he not know he's getting it? No, we don't know. He's got a oh, right. Is it his birthday something? No, what it is, we're, um, we're going to France. There's about 13 of us doing a tour of France in the summer. All right, okay. 
Okay. But he's got an old 1999 bike. Right. And now with the emissions there, his bike's not allowed. Oh, no way. So we said, I can't come. So his wife said, I'll buy yeah, my bike right. then. Right, there she is. All right, well, I'll give you this. Keys are in the ignition. Brilliant. But his pack. Lovely. Yeah. Yeah, see if you've got a clue about this. Right. You should have the shock of his life. <laughs> I was actually yeah. closer to Ireland than I was my own house. And I, I live in Manchester. Oh. We'll just go straight in the back. Right, we'll go through with these panniers. It should do by the look of it. Yeah, I think we will. Yeah, it will. Lovely. Yeah, just anywhere there on the slabs will do. I can turn it round. Lovely. Sounds lovely. Brilliant. Is this yeah. him? This is him. Oh, but he's put up. I was thinking, what's his car, didn't he? Yeah. Oh, he's got Billy. Oh mate! Alright Bills. Just got some stuff to do. Got some stuff to do. What's going on? Today. Right, going on? Come on, just got to talk you about some stuff, right Bill? I was worried now. What are you are you worried? Yeah, oh, come in here, let me show you. Right, do the, stand there, look at me. Stand there. <laughs> What? Like this. <laughs> what? Right, stand up, right. Keep walking this way. Just look at me, okay? That's all you need to do is just look at me. What, you stand there? I'm scared now. Nothing. Well, so now what you need to do. <laughs> Give that to Tom. You hold them. Hold these and what? Yeah. Just have a look at the first sign. I've got to look at it. Yeah. So what's that say? Oh, yeah, this is what you was on about. So I've been putting this on our Facebook, okay? Bonjour, two out two. So go on, show the, show oh. the camera the signs. So the big secret, okay? Like Bonjour, 2022. Shake. Bonjour, Jesus, what the hell is that supposed to mean? That's hello, I am Goose. That's one more. You are going to France? Uh, how can I go to France? Uh, well, what Sam's done, your wife. Stay there, just look at me. She's brought your ferry ticket and your Euro tunnel ticket. Yeah. Right. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take you on the back of my bike to France. Oh. Taking it be as good as riding your own bike, but um and yeah, there's your tickets. But there's someone else in there, another present. Okay. Yeah, look, look over this way. <laughs> That's your present off your wife. Oh. No, you can <laughs> <laughs> so You know that one? Look at your eyes, you can tell. <laughs> you know that 2017 plate you showed me? Yeah. That's the bike. That's the one you picked out. I died to help Bill. <laughs> Look at his face! <laughs> so you have your wife to thank for that bike? I've been like a bear with What a book is it I think you better give your wife a call. Well, do you like it? Yeah. And all this time, you've been thinking you ain't been coming to France. Put on speakerphone as well. Don't worry if she swears, I'll bleep it out. There you go, there's Goosey's new bike. It's been a nightmare keeping this a secret and getting it delivered. Go on, sit on it. I'll just go round Tom, Tom as I told you. You're on loudspeaker. The bike you bought, mate. Thanks. He was nearly crying. The second 
the second one you bought me as a surprise. Um, Thank you very much. Alright, can I book that on the day after now? <laughs> <laughs> book it anyway, I don't. Thanks. Speak to you later. Love ya. Bye. Well, I'm just going to picture of you for the thumbnail for the video. There we go, this is the big secret. No, it's that, you know, when my ring doorbell went off, it says delivery driver, just speak to Craig. It was me. It was a boy coming in his roof. Quite a lot of it. Was that the right one? Yeah, well, anyone has one. I've two. got the tears in his eyes. I've, oh, got, yeah, I've got it on camera. Start, just press the button. Just press the button. Yep. Hello? Yeah, you got to be chewing it now. Log books in the envelope so you can tax it. Oh, it's in a bit. See you in France, son. That's it, get it clean, get it insured for Sunday. Sunday we'll do the old um, test review. Oh, you might want to thank George at Blade Motorcycles, he sorted it. Thank you, George. Much appreciated. I'll probably do another video. Yeah. That's it, we'll do, um, we'll do a ride review video. So there you go, he's done, he's got it, he's happy, he's going to France.